Hi Libra, welcome to my channel. This is a um, weekend love and general situation ship that reading session for you Libra. I hope you're doing well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good. Okay. This reading for today is for the Libra fans out there. What can I get for Libra, please? What is the message that is meant for you to know? I'm ready for you to know this weekend. The reading for today will include a love reading and a general situation reading. We will also try to pick up new moon in Sagittarius and solar eclipse energy. And this is for you, all right? And thank you guys for coming back here. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. This is for you, Libra, all right? If you would like to further connect with me, Libra, all you have to do is to go to the description box below. You will see all of the details about the social media account, the website. The website will have the details of the blog, the newsletter that we send out. We send out newsletter about astrology, new moon, full moon. And we also send out, um, you know, next 24 hours next 24 hours reading so if you want to be notified about the next 24 hours reading please do subscribe in our newsletter so go towards the website okay so this is for you let's see what's coming towards you weekend reading this is for you libra okay you started off with the knight of swords in reverse the seven of cups the hangman hmm there is a slow release of emotion okay there was a message or there was no message okay i feel like you've been waiting and thinking about like a final call you know the new moon in sagittarius it's a nudge from the universe it is supercharge of energy for you to really complete something and to finally propel with that project with that thinking with that emotions with whatever it is that was stuck okay Eclipse is friendly and it is also supercharged with a lot of reminders. So in here, there's a stuck energy in here that you're still contemplating whether you do it or not, or you wait to wait or not to wait, something like that. But it's a slow release. Yeah, Seven of Cups, Hangman. It seems to be you're going to get a confirmation. Okay, there's some sort of con confirmation from the universe, from sign and synchronicity around you. And the confirmation is about you slowly detaching. For some of you, for, for, for some of you guys, the confirmation, that, the confirmation that you've been waiting is that no respond. That is a confirmation. Yeah, for some of you. You'll come to that point. Like it's just gonna like a light bulb moment where, oh, I've been waiting for a sign. This is the sign. The chariot card in reverse. Yeah, five of pentacles. Um, you would return. Return a call. Okay. Um, there's going to be a sign. There's going to be some sort of sign. There's something that would return a call. And it will... They, they will return a call or a message. And it will confirm you something. For some of you, I'm really getting like... There's a message, but it's empty. Something like like they reply, but it's empty. You can't you 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 can't worth think like there's nothing really inspiring with the message. So that will make you a decision. Okay, um, something with getting a message, but the message is empty or returning a call, and that call is there's nothing to work on to whatever they said. So you're gonna slowly detach with. Oh, like an aha moment where, okay, that is a response. Really? That's it? Mm, there's nothing to work on with that. Well, there's nothing to hang on. Like, there's nothing to um, look forward with that. Is that a reply? It doesn't feel like a reply. So, yeah, five of pentacles. Yeah, you're going to get some sort of confirmation. Confirmation. Okay. It, it will come. It will come. Very, very soon. Okay. Then, um, the next reading is with the Devil card, the Seven of Pentacles, and the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. I feel like this is a love reading for you. Ooh. So, wow. This is Miss Excitement or Mr. Excitement. So, hmm, this is really exciting. Hmm. You have dated someone in the past, or it could be an ex. 
this person is fully single you know it's like sober <laughs> before this person was kind of a player um a player it's like a busy bee okay this person is like a busy it's a very social butterfly it's a very busy bee um busy bee because it is you know you know going from one flower to another flower and to another flower until it came to a point that i am tired i'm gonna be exclusively sitting in one garden okay so this person this this is a love reading this is an ex for someone who did it on and off the mask of being an explorer adora the explorer in terms of love and dating it will come off and the final destination is you so they will try again this ex or someone you dated they really choose the holiday the december month to connect with you because they feel like this is the best time because you're in the mood okay so very very smart move because seven of pentacles i will invest again with my libra because i know that libra will be in a good mood and blah 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 and i will tell libra that you know don't close your door between us i don't want you to think that we miss the opportunity because this is a to be continued so they they will address everything you know like this is a new beginning in terms of love you know it's different feelings but it's the same person and they will even defend themselves or they because knight of pentacles they're willing to kind of explain why they are connecting with you like this person's like okay you might be wondering why i'm rekindling reconnecting with you why i'm trying again this is the reason so they will give you the background of what happened when they were a busy bee or a social butterfly and there's some sort of enlightenment like it's you know it's like a solar eclipse new moon sagittarius so your perception of them will expand and you never expect that you will understand the side of the story their side of the story something like that so this whole thing this ace of pentacles it wouldn't just happen it would come to um it's important for them to explain, to make you realize, to make you feel like I'm not just connecting for the sake of connecting. I've got an agenda. Okay, so if, because they will take charge. So if you allow them to take charge, you ask the right question, they will answer like, this is a tell -all. Ask me anything. I'll tell you. Hmm. Very precise. They're, they don't even blink and they don't stammer. So you kind of know like, oh, they're probably telling the truth. And it matches for some of you guys you would even look at their social media account because they will tell oh i was traveling and this and that you'll even look at their social media account to like hmm, will i trust this okay let me match that details in there and this you know cross examine cross you know blah 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 and you will eventually agree or kind of be not persuaded but logically it makes sense so you've got this ace of pentacles with you and um, so that's the second reading. The third reading is you've got the five of cups. Okay. You're moving on. You're moving on. It's healing. Five of wands. Mm. Queen of swords. X again. Well, this could be someone you did it on and off. This is definitely just an X. A love reading again. Because you have moved on. You're kind of looking forward to 2022. You're looking at your travel. This is unexpected. This is an out of the blue. Mid, mid month. You know, like, oh, this and that. You know. Um, you have so much, I think. Like, you're looking into invitation with friends or to invite friends. I don't know. For some reason, I'm, I'm seeing you looking at movies and shopping. And then for some reason, while you're browsing. You know, like, you're browsing, you know, like movies stuff like that you know like doing online stuff your mobile browsing 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 five of wands while you're so busy preoccupied a call incoming call and for some of you you don't recognize the number because you deleted it for some of you the number is still say an x ring 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 queen of swords you're like what why are they calling me what is this for so you're quite shocked annoyed but it's going to give you a smirk 
Mm, they're calling me. You won't answer it right away. I'm seeing you not answer it right away. You're going to wonder and ponder. You're going to prepare yourself if you answer this call. Like, I think you will allow it to miss call or voicemail. And then you're going to pull yourself together and call them back or text them back. But I don't know. For some reason, it's unexpected. You're unprepared for this. You're quite happy and at the same time surprised. Because you never expect that they would, you know, touch base with you. It's a person who has a very, um, they have very nice smile. And their feet is so straight and so sparkly. So you like the way they smile. This person, in short, this person makes you smile. Yes. So prepare. Prepare. Because this, this is an incoming call. You don't want to miss it. I think you will miss it, but you will follow up. And you're gonna get yourself prepared because for some of you the reason why you did not answer the phone because it's a facetime so you want to make you want to look pretty when this happened right so there's a preparation coming from you anyhow it is a pleasure doing the reading to you guys i will see you soon you have a great day bye bye